The East Bay Municipal Utilities District is performing an engineering wonder to make sure an earthquake does not keep water away from Alameda. The island has no reservoirs of its own. KTV Tom Vacar spent the day in Alameda where a huge pipeline more than a half mile long will soon be hidden and protected under the Oakland Alameda estuary. Alameda completely relies on water piped in from East Bay mud through four old and vulnerable pipelines. One being replaced right now is an 80-year-old, rigid, brittle, cast-iron pipe highly susceptible to major quakes. It is flexible, it is durable, it is very strong, and it is very resilient. This pipe will run 150 feet below the estuary, where the ground is much more firm and more resistant to earthquakes, as opposed to the current pipe, which is much higher up and far more susceptible to being destroyed. We're actually replacing the, the four existing pipelines with three new pipelines, uh, and this is the first of those. It took almost a decade to accomplish. We actually started the design of this project uh, with planning phases in 2014, so it has taken us a long time to get to this point. There's 3,000 feet of pipe here, and it's very, very heavy. And that means when it's going to be pulled, it has to be pulled slowly at the rate of about three and a half to four feet every minute. Once that is accomplished, that is half the job. The other half of the job is hooking it up to the main system, which will make sure that Alameda has the water it needs. Another new pipe will be inserted into the old one to bring partially treated recycled water for parks, landscaping, and use in cooling towers, saving potable water for human use. We want to make sure that we can diversify that supply as much as we can, and recycled water is an important part of that. It's all part of an ambitious $2.5 billion plan over the next five years. We have infrastructure, some of which is almost 100 years old. And so our job is to replace, renew, and improve the infrastructure that we have. Included in the plan? Building 127 miles of new pipelines, upgrading several water treatment plants and Lafayette Reservoir, as well as overhauling many neighborhood reservoirs and pumping plants. Tom Baker, KTVU, Fox 2 News.